Hey, it's Jeff here, and I don't usually do videos like this where I kind of do these little vlogs about personal things in my life. I do a little occasionally, but very rarely, uh, but as I mentioned in a video, a couple of videos ago, I'm going to be going in for heart surgery uh, in a few days. In fact, this video I'm doing right now could be the very last video I do for quite some time, uh, depending on how well I recover. But the reason I'm doing this video today is I'm holding this big basket on my knee in my living room. Uh, where I work, I work with a bunch of really good people. They gave me this kind of recovery kit, a kit where I can, that I can use after my surgery to help recover because I'm probably going to be laid up for many, many, many weeks. And it's just really nice. It was a surprise. They called me at the office uh, saying, we need your help with something. So I went down there, and then, surprise! So here are some of the nice things. My, I'm getting heart surgery. And the people that, just to kind of put this in perspective, I'm getting heart surgery, and the people I work with work in the medical department in the state agency I work for. So they put some thought into this, and they are experts in this area. So one of the gifts I got was this, well, Boston Red Sox neck rest. I'm going to be spending a lot of time resting, I'm sure, uh, in a recliner. And I got this neat, really cool, I mean, take a look at this thing. It's a pillowcase. And it's designed with beer style bottles. Bottles uh, advertising beer styles, like box and Pilsners and Mars and beer, Mars and beers and porters and stouts and dries and everything. This was specially made just for me. It's a one-of-a-kind uh, It's a one of a kind uh, design. I think it's really, really cool. Put it on the pillow because I'm going to be resting a lot, that's for sure. And then, of course, I won't have much to do while I'm laid up following surgery. I'll be doing a lot of puzzle books. And here are a couple of the puzzle books they gave me. They're kind of nice, don't you think? Sudoku and crosswords. A heating pad. Now that's something that's going to come in big. It's going to be really helpful for me, I'm sure. I'm going to really have to uh, put some heat on my wounds, as it were, because they're going to be cutting down my chest, of course, and my leg, because uh, they're taking a vein from my leg for the bypass piece, and then cutting in my chest to get into my heart. So a heating pad is probably going to help alleviate some of the pain. Total Home Soft and Strong Tissue Paper. Why not? I'm going to be blowing my nose. It's going to hurt when I do that. And of course I'm going to be taking a lot of sponge baths at first because after heart surgery you're not going to jump into the shower. You're probably going to be doing more sponge baths. And they gave me this nice little, you know, washcloth thing. Uh, wash pad thing. Let's see. What other goodies did they give me? This is really interesting. This is a you can't imagine how soft this blanket feels. I'm going to be wrapping this around myself a little bit, I'm sure. <laughs> uh, it's so soft. It's like velvety soft. It's like uh, it's like this soft, almost fur-like character. It's not real fur, but it's a real soft, velvety. I'm going to really snuggle up with this, I'm sure, uh, when I need to wrap myself in some comfort. And... This is something I guess you can either eat as a candy or put it in your coffee or whatever. Rich and creamy coffee flavored, 30 calories per piece. Coffee flavored candies. I'll put the snack on. I'll give me two of those. And one of the things I'm going to do when I go into surgery next week is I'm allowed to bring certain things with me. You're allowed to bring a book, your medications you need, change your clothes. A cell phone, things of that nature. There's not a lot you're allowed to bring, but you are allowed to bring some stuff. Uh, the hospital will provide otherwise, so they gave me a tote bag. Which I will use this tote bag to carry all the things I'm allowed to bring to the hospital. Brooks Brothers. Hey, there you go. High quality stuff. And some moisturizer for my lips. Gotta keep that, uh, keep yourself moisturized. And like I told you, the folks that provided me these, gave me these wonderful, unexpected, and just thoughtful gifts were from the medical department where I work, so antibacterial soap. <laughs> yes, I'll be cleaning with antibacterial soap uh, when I get my surgery. So, And then, of course, 
Alright, they put it all in this nice woven laundry basket. Because they were they told me they got so much stuff they ran out of room so they bought a laundry basket. Well, why not? Something to store it in, and I can always use a laundry basket. So I really want to thank my colleagues that I work with for uh, this nice gesture for being so thoughtful and wonderful to me. And, uh, you know, surgery is going to be something I'm a little nervous about. I'm not going to lie about that. You know, not, not every day one has heart surgery. But, of course, as we all heard, uh, heart surgery heart surgery has gone so far. They've made so many vast improvements and, and so on. And, uh, you know, the type of surgery I'm getting is actually kind of routine. But it's still going to be, you know, still going to be an invasive kind of uh, surgery. It's something that's going to have me laid up for quite a long time. So I want to thank my colleagues for this very nice gifts. It was very unexpected. Uh, made me feel really good. And uh, I'm looking forward to using this stuff when my surgery is complete. So whether or not you see me again before my surgery, thanks for stopping by.